I'm going to share uh, with you some of the results we uh, collected uh, during the NOMAS uh, field study in, in uh, the summer of uh, 2013. Uh, um, but before I start, I would like to uh, acknowledge uh, my, uh, the co-authors, the list uh, for their contribution. And uh, I also like to acknowledge the uh, help and assistance uh, from the, the colleagues uh, of the uh, NOMAS uh, project and uh, also from the rough uh, staff and C-130 uh, crew members. Uh, and this research is uh, supported by uh, National Science Foundation through the, the three uh, grants. Um, as uh, Chris uh, pointed out uh, earlier, uh, we have uh, 19 uh, research flights uh, during the, the field study, uh, and we have uh, a valid uh, HONOR data for uh, 16 of, of uh, those flights. But today I'm going to uh, share with you uh, the results we got from the uh, five flights uh, in the southeast, uh, eastern uh, US uh, in, in this region. Um, uh, in addition to, to HONOR, we also uh, measured particulate nitrate and nitric acid uh, by my group and other uh, related uh, parameters uh, by other uh, by, by collaborators. Uh, and we also uh, collected uh, aerosol um, samples on, on uh, uh, telephone filters. And we uh, conducted uh, laboratory experiments uh, in the la uh, went back into uh, Albany and we uh, uh, to determine the uh, photolysis rate constants of a particular nitrate uh, to produce HONO and NO2. Uh, and based on the uh, five samples uh, we, we have for the, the southeastern U.S., uh, we determined that uh, the rate constant uh, is between this range with a mean and median uh, value there. And it, as, as you can see, it's, it's, the range is quite large. Uh, uh, but it's uh, narrow, much narrower than the, the overall data we, we have for the whole uh, field com campaign. Um, so it's varied a lot. Uh, uh, but this uh, value is normalized uh, to a so-called uh, 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 standard condition of, or four-sign condition uh, on, on a uh, on a uh, ground surface, uh, well, which uh, uh, the uh, the natural gas phase uh, fatalis rate constant uh, under that condition is uh, seven times ten to the uh, minus seven per second. So uh, the, this value is uh, a few hundred times uh, uh, greater than the uh, gas, uh, natural gas photolysis. So it's very fast. Um, this uh, figure shows uh, the uh, vertical profiles of honor for the uh, all five uh, flights. And the concentration in the free troposphere is quite low. It's just a low, lower PPT level. Uh, in the uh, boundary layer, uh, the, the concentration range from uh, about 5 PPT to up to uh, 30, 40 PPT in the southeast uh, US. But uh, this is uh, in the, the, uh, the power plant plume. Uh, those are power plant plumes. The power plant plumes, uh, the whole concentration could be the, go up uh, as high as like 80 ppt. Um, well, one thing I would like to point out is that uh, the, uh, the, there's usually, you, you can see a uh, uh, wide, uh, widespread uh, horizontally in, in hollow concentration. Uh, that would reflect uh, the horizontal gradient, as uh, Chris pointed out uh, earlier, uh, because uh, the air, the, the influence from a certain uh, like urban area, uh, then you, you could see when you fly horizontally in, in the same uh, altitude, then you, you could see the, some, some gradient. And as you, uh, you can see from the next uh, slides later. Uh, but if you average the 
each uh, altitude, the height, then you basically you can see very uniform uh, uh, vertical distribution of pollen. Um, so it's surprising to see that the vertical distribution is quite uniform, but horizontally it's quite, quite scattered. Um, this is the, uh, the, the there, are, there are two flights, one's uh, flight number four and number five. Uh, in, uh, in the, the uh, Alabama and Mississippi uh, area, um, and um, central central view side is somewhere here, um, and so this is a very uh, it's relatively clean uh, forested site, um, and in the the figures here show that the uh, you see the the altitude and the honor concentration, and on on the blue one. On this one is uh, NOx and uh, SO2, and the, the two top uh, uh, top panels are for uh, research flight uh, four, and this uh, research flight uh, five and in, in the bottom. Um, and as you can see, you can see the like a zig, uh, the up down uh, like a saw like uh, uh, variations uh, in both honor. And, and, and NUX, and this reflect the uh, horizontal gradients. We, when we move, uh, go the, the aircraft uh, go around in, in, in the, the racetrack pattern, we we'll repeat sort of uh, the, 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 uh, the, the concentration distribution up, up and down. Um, uh, but you can see, if you use, uh, this is the altitude, you can see that the bottom one or the higher one doesn't change as much. Uh, uh, if you uh, if go from the uh, about a few hundred, hundred meters above to about thousand meters uh, above ground, um, so this is what, what I, I mentioned earlier. Um, the uh, the difference between the two uh, flights are the air uh, flow is from the west for the number four and uh, from the north uh, in number five, and uh, you can see the air is cleaner, uh, you could see the NUX level is lower uh, in number four, between 100-200 ppt, uh, but uh, higher in uh, number five, especially in, uh, in, in the, this racetrack affected by uh, Birmingham and in this racetrack affected by Nashville, uh, the, the, the air flow is from, from the north. Um, We did some uh, budget calculation for Honor, and the the red uh, circle uh, is the Honor uh, loss rate, uh, and this is uh, predominantly uh, by uh, fatalities, um, and lifetime is uh, between 10 to 12, uh, 13 uh, minutes. Uh, we calculate the Honor formation. Uh, through uh, a few uh, different reactions. Uh, one is a an NOH, uh, NOH re reaction, um, and the second one is an uh, uh, OH plus uh, NO2 reaction on, on surface, on, on uh, aerosol surface. Um, as you can see, the NUX uh, is not an important precursor. We also uh, check the uh, calculate the, the formation from uh, excited NO2 uh, uh, reaction with water, and this is very small also. Uh, it's uh, it, it, it negligible. Uh, we calculate uh, uh, contribution from particular natural photolysis uh, by uh, using our own uh, photolysis rate constant for each flight, uh, and uh, uh, our own uh, particular natural uh, measurements. It's not continuous. We, uh, in some, uh, some, uh, sometime, some period we have the data. Sometimes, uh, some periods we don't. Uh, but uh, what you can see is that this is obviously is the, uh, the predominant source for for Hono in the uh, relatively clean uh, air mass. <coughs> Of course, in, in the, in the uh, plume, uh, the urban plumes or in the uh, power plant plumes, the NUS could be uh, important precursors. Uh, but the, 
the uh, it's no perfect fit. Uh, you could see sometimes you could see the fit here, but sometimes you could account only half of that. But this vari variation is, I, th I think, it's uh, due to the, uh, the the fact that we use a just uh, you average uh, rate, fatality rate constant for particular nitrate. But we, as I, I mentioned earlier, the, the rate could vary a lot from um, from one flight to another, and it's uh, reasonable to expect that it's varied uh, from places to, to places, to different air mass. So that's why the, the sometimes it underestimate uh, the, the, the formation rate. Sometimes uh, over could overestimate the, the formation rate. But you could see this is the one of the the most important predominant uh, the horn source. Uh, this is the uh, research flight uh, number 11, and we go around uh, and pass uh, through different uh, uh, emission uh, areas. Uh, these are two fire, uh, power plants, and this is uh, Birmingham. And so this, there are some uh, uh, urban emissions here and some power plant emissions here. And as shown here, this is a power plant, uh, uh, urban emission and power plant emission uh, shown uh, as uh, Suggested by uh, the NOx and and also NO2 uh, uh, time series. Um, we did some uh, budget calculation, and again, uh, mostly uh, the particular natural fatalities is important, except in the those are uh, the high. It's not working. Uh, run out of battery, but wow. Well, uh, except in the power plant plumes, uh, the the majority. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, except in the uh, the power plant plumes, uh, the NUS could be a, a, a major uh, contributor to to horn formation. Uh, this is uh, flight number uh, 17. Uh, Chris mentioned this one, and it's interesting to to see we fly just back and forth in, in, in this area, and you can see the the, this, uh, the saw like uh, up and down uh, repetition um, due to the, uh, the the horizontal gradient uh, in, in in the concentration. Um, there's a, a we run into a power plan somewhere here on the way back and in this uh, under this uh, condition the NUS becomes uh, a, a very important uh, uh, precursor here um, but uh, outside that uh, particular natural uh, photolysis again is the, the, the most important one but uh, we underestimate uh, that uh, in, in some area here Also, I'd like to mention, uh, point out that you can see that uh, it's not always that uh, when you go, go uh, fly lower, you get a higher honor. Uh, that's what we ex would expect because the uh, ground, so uh, ground surface usually is a, a honor source. But we don't, sometimes we don't see that. We, we, we saw this kind of a, a phenomenon uh, in a, a few times. Uh, that would suggest that uh, Ground surface uh, may not be a very important uh, a, a horn source for the air, uh, like a few hundred meters above. Um, uh, so the horn production is mostly within the air mass. It's, it's so, so, so called uh, volume production or, uh, or in situ production. Uh, so it's not contributed from the ground surface. Um, and the last slide I want to show you is number 18. Um, and this is to study the nighttime chemistry, hormonal chemistry, and also the daytime uh, sort of like profiling. Uh, I want to show, well, the, the, the problem we run into here is that uh, there's a very strong uh, uh, horizontal gradient uh, when you fly back and forth. Uh, so we don't really get a uniform uh, distribution of hormonal and other parameters. Uh, so to uh, take 
take into consideration the, the variation, uh, tempor uh, the special uh, variation, uh, we uh, sort of plot uh, the, the time versus the Horner versus, uh, over Knox. Because the daytime, the particular natural photolysis is not like imp it's no longer a source. Um, and so we, we see that there is basically within the uncertainties, uh, there's no, no change. So the nighttime accumulation of Horner in, in the AMS about, well about the boundary there is not important. Um, and this is the, the summary, and I don't want to go through uh, all this except that uh, we have a, another uh, poster uh, who, who discuss uh, more detail about the, the, this, this process as a, a NUX uh, recycling mechanism.